Yo dudes, it is a uh, trading here, back with another Minecraft map. Today we are playing Just Gone Camping. Remember Just Gone House, the, the detective where you had to find evidence and uh, figure out your own solution of what happened there? This is the sequel, this is Just Gone Camping. Uh, it's a series, uh, you're being a detective who must look for evidence at a crime scene and then make a final decision. Uh, Just Gone Camping is the second map in the series, so Just Gone House was the first one. Find six evidences, we need to find chloroform, piece of cloth, key, shovel, gasoline and a rope. After then we have to make a decision. Um, yeah, this map was made by Stock. Stock, Stock, I don't know, Stock. So yeah, um, Just Gone Camping, we've done Just Gone House, um, here's Stock. I've done all the settings, so let's hop right in. Just gone camping. Well, here we are. I think I have slowed us. Yep. Music is fine. Official note, 3rd of October. Hello again, detective. I am Mr. C. Mr. C. Oh, he sees everything. Get it? I received information about a murder at a camp. The main suspect is the guard of the place. Your test is to find all evidence, and in the end, decide the killer's fate. Okay. Can I, I'm, this is my car, I am here, or... Hello? Housekeeping? <clears throat> so what I remember from the, the last one is that it could be hidden in very well places. So we're just gonna have to look around and find any evidence. Anything that could... Uh, I don't want to skip the night, I think. I did, however, sleep in a bed, which is fine. Could be on top of things, under things. This is just food and stuff. So, yeah, this is one. This one is basically just explore and find the missing items. It could be hide items hidden inside things and such. Trust me, you'll, you'll see what I mean once I find my first evidence. That is, if I would find my first evidence. It's gonna, it could take a while before I find my first evidence, but it could also be like, oh, there it is. For now, we have nothing yet. But you may never know, you may never know what you find in a campsite like this. Always check the furnace, you may never know if there's something inside of the furnace. For now we're basically just scanning the camp for any hidden items. Um, I don't know how big this camp is. The campsite could be like huge, it could be like small. As you guys can see, you cannot parkour on top of things, but you could go one layer up. So I don't know if I'm already searching for stuff. I might be, because in the other one I literally went into it and then that basically happened. We have a well. With no... Hidden interactables? I do not know yet. There might be something inside the well. There's a hole here with a shovel. A shovel hidden in the deposit. Was shovel one of the... The shovel was indeed one of the six items we needed. So we found a shovel. Great. Um, yeah. So yeah, that's what I meant by items can just be on the floor, but also they could be on top of something. Um, is this a house of sorts? You could be hiding something everywhere in this house. Could be a hidden passageway behind nope like I said there could be but there isn't always one but yeah I'm skeptical because there could be things on top and I just 
don't know yet. I don't know how well hidden everything is. Oh, that was the guard's house. Okay, maybe I should read the notes. I can actually bing bong the bell. There is also a downstairs area. A chest and a furnace. And a hidden chest. Is there a chest under the chest? That's one of the oldest tricks, of course. I found the gasoline. Hidden in the hopper. Interesting. We have two out of six items up there. But that does not mean it will go fast from here on out. We don't actually know what happened. Because who got murdered? Did they tell it in the story? No. I just found gasoline there and a shovel in a random hole. Which doesn't actually say much because it's just a gasoline generator. Obviously you could do stuff with gasoline but you could just derp around as well with gasoline. Haha a key behind the swing. Rocking chair, swing, whatever you want to call it. It's basically the same in my eyes. Um, this is a lonely campsite. Campsite. I don't really know. Is there supposed to be something with this campfire? I don't even. I don't think I've seen the whole layout yet. There's a chest here. With a lot of flint. What would I need flint for? I could make flint and maybe steel for fire. Maybe. This is all just theories I'm, I'm working on in my head. Could be something, there could be nothing. This is all we have found out until now. This is, by the way, a li little bit bigger than I was expecting it to be for a campsite. But it's not a problem. We can just try and find evidence somewhere. I don't know, there's like a passageway sometimes, so we can just at least check those out. Maybe they were sneaking behind the trees to have their uh, special uh, moment or just some alone time, which also works sometimes. Like it would be a very good place to just hide or chill here if you want to get away from like the supervisors. All right, what else? No one sneaking around behind trees. We've got this upper place. Of course we have the pond. I know I haven't checked the pond yet. I walked past the pond and I was like, nah, I ain't checking that yet. But we could always check. What the heck is this? Hello? Oh, it's the bathroom. Oh. Aha. We found some paper. I don't know why I need paper, but we found it. Uh, paper. Well, it might be toilet paper. It could be something, it could be nothing. <laughs> toilet. Okay, nothing on top of the toilet. Let's check the girl's bathroom. I am a detective. I am allowed to go into the girl's bathroom. And there's no one here, so that's fine. Aha, more hidden. And chlorofoam. Why is there chlorofoam in the girl's bathroom? Woman, yeah, woman bathroom. We still need to find the key. No, we have the key. What, what, what am I missing? I am missing a rope and a piece of cloth. A rope. OK. 
Okay, well, we at least found four items which are needed for investigation. Uh, there's a bag. It's kind of suspicious not putting anything in here, but on the other hand... Just be me. Huh. Nothing. Oh. I broke it. I broke the tiny farm. That wasn't what I meant to do, but it happened. So we don't talk about that. Anyhow, we still have the pond. And this might be my entrance. This looks like my entrance. So we should check out the pond, I guess. Um, yeah. Fishing pond. Or it's just a pond with some fish. And there is indeed parkour. Which I can't do on slow. And there's food for the fish. Hiding holes. Does that mean there's something hidden down here? Nope. You know, as an investigator, I have to be very thorough, but swimming underwater into tiny patches, I don't think they are what you usually look for. But apparently you find a piece of cloth under the water. I still don't get the full picture, but... It's fine, I guess? There's one I missed, apparently. Okay, we have five out of six items for our investigation. We're still missing the... I literally just put the rope. Rope. We're missing a rope. I or rope. Where would I hide it? Probably on top of something or hidden away in the bushes. And I don't think it should be outside, but it never hurts to check. Several bad puns later. top of the house of the sheriff I found all the evidence okay now now it's being redirected to the site the killer's fate well it's great and all how do I do that so a murder about a camp the main suspect might be uh, the guard, but I don't know where the well the murder happened at the camp. There was a rope on top of the guard's tower. Um, there was a shovel in the deposit, gas in the hopper, a key behind the rocking chair. I don't even know where the key is for. Chloroform hidden in the woman's bathroom. To be honest, I can't link any of this. This is not substantial evidence to put somebody in prison. There was a murder happened. Okay. And there was a shovel in a place where you can dig. In a deposit. We don't even know what's buried there. Was there the body? Was there something? I don't know. Uh, gasoline was in a hopper next to a gasoline generator for power. Which is absolutely fine. There was a key that was hidden behind the rocking chair. I don't know what the key is for. It could have been a key that somebody had fallen out of their pocket while they're on the rocking chair. 
chloroform in the woman's bathroom, which is kind of weird, but it was on top with the paper and you can use... Uh, can you use chloroform to clean the place? There was a piece of cloth hidden in the lake. Um, cool. There's lots of stuff in the lake. And there was a rope on top of the guard's house roof. That's the only thing that might be substantial. I don't think I... Sh I chose freedom, okay? I, I can't link any of this. News. End of terror. Arrested now, Arthur Hemsley. The individual was on the run for murdering six people. A sad fact to mention the death of a 19-year-old girl, the first victim at the local camp. At the time, the case was dropped by the detective who was investigating. If he had taken a better attitude, the damage would have been less. Oh. So he did do it. Well, I guess I'm just a bad detective then. Um, I don't know if the things are in this exact same spot. Uh, I can check. By, for example, going towards the uh, cabin. So I guess I got the bad ending. Um, is there a rope? Nope. Welp. Um, great. There were more more people murdered. By detective. Well, not by me, but... Great. I didn't see the link, okay? I didn't have enough information. If there was like a tiny bit of information, like a book or something, or I don't know, or how the murder happened, but it wasn't enough for me. Like, I received information about a murder at a camp. Um, so yeah, <laughs> apparently he did it. Uh, I didn't notice it. So yeah, um, the last one that was... Um, the child who saw, uh, murdered his parents because he was uh, mentally damaged. I did see that one because I had a what like two tabs and a link. But yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, Minecraft map. Me uh, being Detective Ian and not seeing the links. I don't know. If you know how to see the links or how I should have known he was the killer, let me know down in the comments below. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Yeah, dudes, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment down any ideas below.